it's the first leaf of fall, and now you have the best idea. Before we head out, it is very important that we make a list of fall things, okay? We are on a journey of Lobby Hobby. We have just made it back home. We're about to convert this entire Lona mansion into a fall fun festive house. see this. Lamas, where did you get this leaf from? You have that look on their face, guys. They literally have that look on their face like they ha they're up to no good. I'm just so curious because how did they get a real leaf inside of their house? Let me. Mm-hmm. Oh. Oh, Lama. <laughs> did you guys get that? Lama said her and Fluffing ate a huge breakfast and then they passed out and when they were dreaming, they felt a huge breeze come into their house and this leaf flew into the house and it hit them and then they were just sniffing it out for a really long time and then they got the best idea. Fluffy, get over here. Fluffy, tell me more about this leaf. Mm-hmm. <gasps> it's the first leaf of fall and now you have the best idea. Okay, Lamas, what is your idea? That's perfect because today I really want to do something fun. Mm-hmm. <gasps> yes, Lamas! So the Lamas just told me they want to transform their entire house into a super pretty fall decoration house. Lamas, that is literally so cool and I'm so excited for that because like now that it's fall, like I think we need to get super festive because that's the thing about fall and all holidays. We have to get really festive and have super fun. Okay, Lamas, now you gotta turn on your sensitive noses. Well, actually, the Lamas always have their sensitive noses on. I don't think they ever turn them off, but use your sensitive noses, turn them on super high because we're about to go out into the towns, into all of the cool shops to go find the awesome fall decorations. And we're literally gonna transform the outside of the house, the inside of the house, and find all the cool things to decorate their house. Okay, Lamas? What's up, Fluff? Oh. Oh. Fluffy said she also really wanted to make the most giant leaf she's ever wanted to create ever. Fluffy, what does it even mean? Oh, you wanna make your own leaf and set it outside the house? Just a super giant one? Wow, Lamas, that's a really good idea. Okay, let's do it all. We have the whole day, Lamas. Okay, let's get started right now. Are you ready, Lama Bean? <laughs> Lama Bean is so ready. Are you ready, Fluff? Fluff! Fluff is obviously super ready because she hasn't blinked. Let's do this thing! Yeah! Let's go! All right, Lamas, before we head out, 
it is very important that we make a list of fall things, okay? So, Lama Bean, huge question for you, okay, Lama Bean? What is the first thing you think of when you think of fall? Say it. <laughs> Did you guys get that? Lama Bean said corn mazes. Yes, Lama Bean, those are so fun. So, let me write that down. Corn mazes. That would be so cool to go to. I already wrote down what I thought of. I always think of pumpkins when I think of fall. Like, pumpkins are so cool. Like, llamas, maybe one of these days we gotta carve a pumpkin, okay? When it gets closer to Halloween. Okay, Fluff Bean, what is the first thing you think of when you think of fall? Let us know. Don't think too hard. Tell us right now. Oh, Fluff! Oh, Fluff Bean. Oh, my goodness. Did you guys hear Fluff? Fluff Bean said that she thinks of candy canes. Oh, no, Fluff. Fluff Bean, candy canes are for Christmas. Of course, it was a food item. But you know what food item that has to do with fall? Candy corns, Fluff Bean. Oh, yeah, look at Fluff Bean. Her face just lit up. She's super excited. She loves candy corns. Actually, anything that has to do with food. So write that down. Candy corns. All right. Now, I want to know, what do you guys think of when you think of fall? Leave a comment down below right now. What is the first thing that comes to your mind? I wonder if there's other things out there that we didn't think of. Well, of course there's. There's a lot of things that have to do with fall. I think a couple more things, Thomas. What's that little bean? A uh, scarecrow. Yes. Oh, those are so scary. Scarecrow. Mm. What about, what about, oh, I know, I know, a ghost. Ooh, because fall, it gets it gets into the spooky season, and then it's Halloween. So I'm gonna write ghost down. Ghost. Okay, Fluffy, how about you give us one more thing, and then we can go to the store and find all the cool things to decorate your mansion with. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh, Fluffy, yes! Fluffy said she just thought of a s'more, like a marshmallow s'more. Yes, Fluffy, that does make sense. Campfires are definitely a thing in the fall because it starts to get super chilly and then everybody has the campfires to warm up. Yes, Fluffy, we should make a fire one day and have a huge campfire. That'd be so fun. And also, you know one of my favorite things about the fall and the cold weathers? The hot chocolates. I love hot chocolate. Like, that is my favorite thing. If I go to Starbucks, I'm getting the hot chocolate. Mm -mm. Okay, so what was that? Oh, yeah. Campfires, s'mores. Now that we have our list of fall items, we're gonna look at this, we're gonna read it, we're gonna take it with us so it can soak into our little llama heads and we have all these thoughts in our minds when we're shopping. Right, llamas? Right, all right, let's go to the stores. Oof. Okay, llamas, what I want you to do is you have to think of all the stores you wanna go to, okay? As we ride in the car, think of all the stores and let me know, all right? I'm just gonna buckle my crazy little llamas in. They have to be buckled in because, you know, mama raised a safe bean. We cannot forget to buckle. And these llamas, they always insist on sitting together. It's because they're best friends. Llama and Flopping, they're just forever best friends, forever. They hang out every day, 24 hours. All right, crazy llamas, think. So we have just made it to our first store. Little Fluff Bean was insisting that we came to Lobby Hobby. And we are here right now. And let me tell you guys, we haven't been to Lobby Hobby in so long. It's been many years. But the llamas love this store. Right, llamas? Oh, look how cute they are back there. These llamas are so adorable. I love them. Anyways, I have a great feeling that Lobby Hobby is going to have a lot of good things in there. Like a lot of fall, cute little things that we can find and get. Because here's the thing. Lobby Hobby actually has their sign. It's orange. Their sign is orange. And that's good luck. Okay, Lama Bean? It's good luck, Lama. Because the color of fall is literally orange. Like, name, a, name another color that's a fall color. Like, I think the top one is definitely orange. And then probably yellow. And then probably brown. What's another fall color? Leave a comment down below. We really just want to know. But yeah, me, Little Lombie, and Fluffy, we're going to go in there right now. We're going to use our sensitive noses. We're going to be like, all throughout the store and find all the cutest things to put on the llama's mansion. So, let's do this thing! Yeah! Come on, llamas! All right, llamas, let's go! Oh, something smells a little stinky back here. Oh, llamas. Has someone been tooting? Llama, who was it? Fluff? I see, I see the sweat pouring out Flipping's face. It's okay, Flipping. We all toot, okay? Just embrace it. All right, let's go to that Lobby Hobby. We are on a journey of Lobby Hobby. 
What's that, Amis? Oh, yeah, we do need a carb. <gasps> Perfect. How about this one, Fluff Bean? What's that, Fluff? You're really embarrassed to ride in this, Fluff Bean. This is perfect for you. You llamas fit perfectly in here. I know, Fluff Bean. Oh my gosh, Fluff Bean says she's too old for it. She's in kindergarten and she doesn't want to ride in this. What's that, llama? Oh, llama Bean says she really wants the race car one. Llama Bean, they don't have that here, llama. Llamas, just sit in this. You're not even doing anything. All you have to do is sit. Like, you know what, Lamas? How about I sit in here and then you push me around? See? Lamas says they don't want to move their feet. Mm. Lamas these days. Guys, we did not have to go far at all. Literally, when we walk on the store, two steps. Well, Lamas didn't take any steps, but I took two steps and we already found super cute things. So, Lamas, go ahead, pick out something that looks really fall. Oh, llamas. This tree, it definitely looks like it. Look, look, they have orange leaves. This is perfect. How much is it? $50. Fluffy, I really hope you brought your money because that's really expensive. She said she was counting on the llama mama's credit card. Of course she was. Okay, Fluff, you're so cute, you get away with it. Let's get it. This will look really good inside the llama's house or on the outside. We're going to have to go home and see how to decorate this. So, llamas, keep that in mind. Okay, Lama, so we have one thing so far. Keep on sniffing. <gasps> oh, Lama Bean, it's the Scarecrows. Oh, these are so cute. And it's perfect because there's two of them. Okay. All right. Guys, we're literally just getting started. Okay, Lama, back in your seat. <gasps> Guys, look what the Llama Mama found. I think this will look so cute for the little Scarecrows to sit in or the Llamas want to sit in. This would look really good on the outside. Okay, Lamas, get excited because I found a great one. Oh, they're excited. All right, Lamas, let's keep exploring. We're literally not even in the store yet. And we already found a lot of the stuff. Oh, Lama. Maybe we can find like some crafty things that we can make. Like, we can make our own. Uh oh, the llamas are going. We can like make our own like fall items. Right, llamas? Llamas love crafts. Okay, let's keep our eyes peeled. <gasps> now that, that looks really soft. This is like softer than fluff bean. Fluff bean. Which one is softer, you or that? <laughs> she said herself. Yeah, fluff bean's pretty soft. So is llama bean. All right, let's keep moving. Okay, llamas, let's see what else we can find. <gasps> oh, llamas, look, look at all those leaves. Now, these are fake leaves, llamas. I know the leaf that was in your house today was real. These are fake, and that's okay, because these are for decorations. Llamas, I think these leaves will look really good all over your mansion, all over it. And, <gasps> oh my gosh, it's lights, so they light up. Llamas, this is so cool. <laughs> You're so excited. Okay, llamas, let's grab a bunch. Come on, Fluff. Oh, yay, we found more things. Okay, let's see what else we can find. Wait, how many leaves should we get? 1,200, that's a lot of leaves. I don't even know how many leaves are on one. There's a lot, but let's get a couple more strands and keep moving. Fluff bean, fluff bean, why are you jumping up there? Why are you trying to build sleep? Fluff bean, that's so dangerous. We have to be safe beans. Uh-huh, oh, fluff. Fluff Bean just told me that she really wants to get the ones at the top because every time she goes shopping, she always gets the items either in the back or at the top, the items that people less touched. Now that makes sense, Fluff. That's a life hack, but those are really high, Fluff Bean. I don't know if we should get those. That's really dangerous. You want? You want to get those? Oh, Fluff. How about you, Lama? Oh, Lama Bean just really wants lettuce. Lama Bean, I know you're hungry, but come on, let's just, let's just gently get them. Okay, Fluff Bean, since you have the coolest llama mama around, I guess I'll help you get the ones at the top. Is that Fluff? Oh, I know. Fluff Bean says she really wants it because it's the fluffiest lead she sees. Okay, Fluff Bean, let's do it. Also, guys, if it sounds like I'm talking weird, it, it's because I am. I have a huge canker sore on my tongue right here, and it hurts really bad. Fluff Bean has like five. Look at Fluffs. It's really hard for her to talk, but... She, she's always talking, like Fluffy talks a lot. 
Like, if you guys know how to speak llama, you would know that Flipping talks a lot. And like, when I say Flipping just said, you'd be like, I already know what Flipping said because I can speak llama too. Anyways, we're gonna try to get those leaves up. So come on, Fluff. I believe in you, Fluff. Be safe though, because Mama is sleeping. Come on, Fluff. Let's do it. Woo, close one, Fluff. Woo, always catching Fluff. Okay, me and Fluffy, we're sweating so much. One more try, Fluff. Oh, Fluff. We're never gonna give up, guys. Never give up. Okay, Flopping, you have one more chance. Use your paws to gently grab the leaves, okay? One more chance, you got this, Fluff, okay? Use all your energies inside your little llama body, okay? You got this, Fluff, come on! One more try! <gasps> Yay, Fluff, you got it! Guys, I can't believe Flopping actually got that. Actually, I can't believe, because these llamas, they never give up. Speaking of the llamas, where the heck is llama bean? Oh, uh, llama bean. Llama? <gasps> llama bean. Llama bean's eating the, the greens, as always, guys. Okay, llama. Now this right here, this does not look like a fall decorative, llama bean. She's starving. What's that, llama? You really want to get it. Okay, llama bean. If you say so, we can get this, okay, llama? Oh, uh, hungry little llamas these days. Come on, llama. Let's go find some other festive things. Maybe some arts and crafts, llamas. Let's go! Oh, llamas, it looks like they're onto something. What is this? <gasps> Ooh, we got some more leaves. The llamas obviously love leaves. Now, what is this? <gasps> oh, look, it's like a little like craft. It looks like a tree house in a swing. Llamas, you think you can do that? Let's see if these llamas can create this. What else is there? Perfect. And we got this turkey looking thing. This is so cool, llamas. Like, we can do all these crafts and decorate the whole house. Okay, llamas? Is that Fluff? Your canker sore's hurting. Mine too, Fluff Bean. Mine too. Llama Bean. Fluff Bean. Look how cute this one is. I don't even know if this is llamas, but I sniffed this one out. It looks like, well, it says fall, so it's a good sign. It looks like it's like a little, like, reef, maybe? Let's see. Maybe. <gasps> Ooh, but Llama Bean. Fluffy, look at these ones. These ones are super cute. I think we definitely need to get one to put on your door. And I think we're in luck because this is the perfect size. This is the most perfect size. Or should we get the more sparkling one? See, this is the thing. There's so many different options, but that's okay. Because the llamas, they always know. Llamas, you choose this one or those. Oh, they like this one. Okay, sling it in the cart. Perfect. That cart is getting really overfilled. Oh, I really wish the llamas brought their monies, but I always have to pay for it. It's okay. Let's keep looking. Oh, look at that. Gobble till you wobble. Hmm. Llamas, should we get it or should we not get it? They really like it. Okay. Let's get it. Look how cute it is. Look at the cute little turkey. That's so cool. Uh oh. I did not know that came apart. Like, is, it, is that supposed to happen? Is this supposed to happen or was it not supposed to happen? Oh no, Namas, what do we do? Should we get it, should we not get it? Uh, I think it's broken. Uh, mm. <sighs> do you guys ever do that in the store when you like you look at something and then you drop it and it's like boom, boom, pop. It's like, and then mom's like, uh, now I have to buy it and she gets really mad. So I guess we do have to buy it. Oop. Oh, Llama's going in hard. <gasps> llama, you found a pumpkin. Look at that. The Llama Bean found a pumpkin. And Llama Bean, this pumpkin is almost as big as you. What are we going to set this on, though, Llama? Oh, Fluff Bean. <laughs> Fluff Bean, it looks like you found a little, like, stand. <gasps> this is perfect. Llama, try it out. Oh, I know, Llama. It's heavy. Oh, Llama. That is literally perfect. Llama Bean, don't pass out. She got so excited she passed out. Llamas, that is teamwork right there. They literally found the cutest thing. You know what, guys? Llamas, when it's not fall, you can literally use this as a dinner table. Like, look, you and Fluff can eat your foods here. Like, this morning, your breakfast was literally all over the floor. Like, where'd you guys even eat that? Did you eat it on a table? Like, what'd you eat it on? Exactly, Llamas, this is perfect. We gotta get this. This is so perfect. Yay! Okay, I wonder if we can find some more things. Let's look. 
Oh my gosh, this cart is literally so overfilled. Okay, I think I'm gonna have to carry the llamas now because we need to start putting stuff like on here. Okay, llamas, let's keep rolling. Let's keep moving. <gasps> More pumpkins. <gasps> okay, llamas, should we get the orange ones? Should we get these colors? Or should we get the white ones or a variety pack? Hmm, I think we should get all of them. This one and all the white ones and all of these. Yes, llamas? <laughs> oh my gosh, guys, these llamas. They're always so excited. If you guys have llamas of your own, do your llamas act like these llamas? Leave a comment down below, because we're super concerned. I really want to know, because like, my llamas, they're super crazy. <gasps> llamas, if you look down this aisle, this is literally the most perfect aisle. We hit the jackpot guys. Look, we can put all these things in the llama's yard. The llama's yard, they're gonna have the best yard on the block. Look at all this stuff. Llamas, get to sniffing. Oh. <laughs> the llamas are so excited, look at them. Okay, I don't even know if we can fit this in the cart. But you know what guys, you always know, we never give up. Perfect. Oh, this one's so cool. I think this one's corn. <gasps> Do you guys ever go in like corn mazes or like in a cornfield? That is the most fun. You know what, sometimes like, if I have to go to the bathroom so bad, like I just go pee in the cornfields. It's the perfect place because you're hidden. Lava bean does it a lot too. Okay, what's next? They went into that fast. This one's so cute. Okay. This is perfect. These llamas, they're just getting so lucky today. They found so many things. Scarecrows. This is literally perfect. Like guys, like everything mini is just so cute. But you have to get it. Hmm. Maybe we should get two. One for llama, one for fluff. Whew. Seems like we're gonna buy the whole store. Hmm. I think we have enough pumpkins and leaves. Thomas, the cart is literally overflowing. I think it's a sign to go home and start decorating. that's just not supposed to be eaten because say that happens like all the time especially with flipping if you guys know flipping loves food but the first thing we're gonna do we're gonna unpack all this and then we're gonna think with our little llama minds on where to place this okay llama bean flipping we have now unpackaged absolutely everything all i can see is just a bunch of oranges and yellows and reds this looks like so much fun llamas now the best part all we have to do now, all we have to do now is rearrange this whole thing to make the mansion look super cute. So I think let's start with these. As you can see, a little fluffy started to open this, and I was just thinking, like, hmm, are we should we like open the hay bales or are they supposed to just stay in the plastic? 
Well, I, I still don't know. Do you guys know? Let us know because I don't know if you're supposed to undo these. It's really messy, and, but fuck me, she's clearly loving it. So we're going to start to unravel it. Oh, blah. Fluff me just fell over. So typical of little fluff. She gets so excited. Just don't eat it, fluff. It's not food. Actually, it is food. I think horses eat that. Okay. So I think this will look really good if we go like this. <laughs> fluff bean. Okay. Llamas. Let's open the other one. Over here. I wonder if this has like a smell. Let me see. Oh my gosh, it does. It smells like, like grains. Like, as almost as if like you're in the field. Like you're prancing through a field. The llamas love to prance through fields. That's one of their favorite activities is to go outside and just play around and have fun with the nature. So I think like this looks really good. It's kind of messy, but I, I think that's the look we're going for. We're going for the Super Bowl festive look. Okay, and then we angle it like that, and like this. So cute. What do you think, Lamas? Oh, Flappy. Tell me what you think of Fluff. <laughs> oh, Fluff. My goodness, Fluff Bean. Fluff Bean said she had the best idea. She thinks that we should stick one of these, the little signs in there. Where's the welcome sign? Oh, yes. Fluff bean, perfect. She thinks we should stick it into the hay bale. Lama bean, what do you think? Oh, Lama bean said yes. Okay, Lama, go ahead. Woo, Lama. All right, let's think. Is that gonna look really good, Lama? Oop. Okay, yeah, I think right there will look perfect. All right, let's put it in. All right, Lama, it's all together now, okay? One. Oops. Okay, Fluff. Get a hold of it, Fluffy. Crazy Lama. All right, let's push. Perfect. All right, the Lama Mama will take over on this one. Okay, there we go. Oh, yeah, that looks great. Maybe if we angle it a little bit. There we go. Where are the other ones? I think the other ones the flower and the corn. All right, Lama Bean. You put this where you think it'll look best. Right there. Yes. There we go. Oh, fucking it's going in. Oh, where's Fluff gonna put it? You want it to go there, Fluff? Woo! Okay, Fluff. I think this is a perfect place for the sunflower. <gasps> Look how cute that looks! Aww. Okay. Actually, yeah, I think that looks good. This looks really good. Lama, sniff out something else you want to put up. Oh, Lama Bean, you want to do something with the pumpkin? <laughs> Lama, like I said, this pumpkin's almost as big as you. Oh, that's a cute place for it, Lama Bean. That fits perfect, right in between the hay bales. Perfect, Lama Bean. Fluffy, what are you doing over there? Oh, I see, okay. You want to you wanna set up the scarecrows. Perfect, Fluff. You know what I'm thinking? got to get off that bench, that cute little bench, Fluff. Let me get the bench. Mm. Woo. Now, Lama Bean, where do you think? Oh, Lama, don't pass out yet. Lama Bean, where do you think this would go perfectly? Uh huh. <gasps> oh, Lama! Did you get that? Lama Bean is so excited because she said she found the perfect spot for the bench. Go ahead, Lama, tell us. Oh, Lama. Yes, Lama Bean! Yes! Okay, right here. Lama Bean, you know what? I think you're really good at this home designing that maybe one day, like if you ever thought about it, you could totally do like a home design, you know, like for other people, maybe other llamas. Hmm, maybe like Lama Dean or Toes, you could ever help them. Okay, let's set the scarecrows up. What even is the purpose of a scarecrow? It's to scare the crows. I really hope there's no crows in this house, you know? But you never know, the llamas always come prepared. Good bluff, Lama Bean. Come on, where's your scarecrow? Oh, good llamas. Oh, Lama Bean. Okay, let's set him next to the other scarecrow. Aww, how cute is that? Perfect. That is so sweet. Okay, what else do we have here? <laughs> 
the llamas went straight for the leaves. Was that llamas? Oh, the llamas getting so excited. Uh huh? Oh my gosh. Oh yeah. I kind of want to do that too. I really want to do that. Llamas said they want to take all the leaves before we decorate them and put them in a huge pile, jump all through the house into the pile of leaves. Llamas, that's a really good idea. I kind of want to do that too. Like I'm a little jealous, but okay, let's do that right now. Let's make, let's put all the leaves together so you can jump into the pile of leaves. Oh my gosh, I can't believe I'm letting these crazy little llamas do that. It's a little dangerous. So the leaves are kind of soft, so it'll make them land softer. Oh my gosh. You guys ever make big piles of leaves during fall? Like you ever like put like a bunch of leaves together and then make like a leaf, like a leaf angel? I've done that before. Okay, there we go, llamas. All right, where do you want to jump from? All the way up here. Oh my goodness, llama. Oh, llama bean. Wow, llama, okay. Gabby, are you ready? One, two, three! Oh, Lama! How was that? Okay, Papi, your turn! Okay, Lama! What's up, Lama? You're gonna do a huge flip! A back flip? Watch out, Lama Bean! Flappy is jumping down into the leaf pile! Here we go! Woo! <laughs> flip! Did you guys see that flip? Flop did like two flips! Flappy, you are so crazy! Okay, it's my turn. I'm just kidding. I can't. I think I'll probably break the llama's house. And plus, the leaf pile would have to be huge. <gasps> but maybe like when the leaves like fall outside, because today like there's only one leaf that we found that fell outside. But maybe when like there's more leaves from fall, we'll like gather like a huge pile of leaves and just jump in it. Would you guys want to see that? Leave a comment down below because maybe me and the llamas like, will make a huge pile and we'll just jump in it for a whole video. Come on, llamas. Let's put up these leaves on your house. Now, where do you think they should go? Oh, that's a great idea. Okay, okay, let's do it. Stay right here. Mommy said she wants to surprise you on where she wants to put the leaves. Like, look how cool this is. Look how cool these leaves are. Oh, they're a bit tangled. Look, these leaves, they light up. Like, it's almost like a scarf. So I'm like, like, what if I walked around in public like this? Like, that would be crazy. People would be like, hmm, she must really like fall. Okay, all right, Fluff. Nama said she had a really good idea on where to put this. Where is it at, Nama? Oh, Nama, I see what you're doing. Oh, very nice, Lama Bean. This is gonna look so cute at the end. But Bean's literally gonna pass out when she sees this. Oh my gosh, Lama, you don't pass out, okay? Put that down here. Very nice. Oh, that's so cute. This, uh huh, just like that. Oh yeah, the llamas are gonna have the coolest house on the block for sure, like for sure. So Fluffy just gave me a great idea. She said she really wants the lit up leaves to go inside of the house, and I was like, oh, yes, Fluffy, because we didn't even think about the inside of the house yet. So let's quickly go in there, Fluffy, and see where we can put this. We gotta make it look really good, okay? Okay, Fluff, where do you think? Okay, Pop, do your thing. Mm. Never give up, Pop. Wow, Pop Bean, you did a great job hanging that up in here. I think it looks absolutely perfect. Like, this is gonna make fall so much better. It's just so cozy and just amazing. Llama Bean, what are you doing over there? Oh, llama sniffing the hay. Okay, let's finish this up. I think next we should definitely hang up this wreath and it should definitely go outside. Like I think right on the door, like this guys. This is what I have in mind. It's gonna look so cute. Like right here. Llama bean, will you do this for me please, little llama? Okay, llama. Hang in there, Fluff. Don't, don't eat the hay, Fluff. Okay, like right here, llama. Let me see where we can hang it up. so festive little flap okay look at it the llamas are so excited okay what do we have left and we got that that oh, the table yes 
And this, I think guys, this is a time where the little pumpkins come into play. Hmm, maybe like right here, Lamas. This looks really good. Okay, Lamas, put some pumpkins on there, okay? The llamas just got done decorating the entire house and I gotta say guys, it looks absolutely amazing. I've never seen the llama house look so decorated ever. I don't think it's ever been decorated like this. Guys, just check it out. It looks so good. You did a great job decorating. What do you guys think? Like, this is just so crazy to me. Because the llamas have never done anything like this to their house before. Like, I'm thinking that since we did this for fall, we should definitely do it for like Christmas and all the holidays. Like, what's another holiday? Valentine's, St. Pat, like all of them, you know? But, no, I mean, I want to know what was your favorite thing about all these decorations? Just let me know. Mm -hmm. <gasps> oh, okay. Did you get that? She said she really liked the corn. She really liked the corn. Now that makes sense, because I do remember Lama Bean telling me that she loves to prance through the field. Like she's a little llama that just likes to go boop, 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 through the cornfields. Flood Bean, what was your favorite thing about the whole decorations? <laughs> oh, Fluff, that does make sense. Because you see, little Fluff, she loves to eat food. And that says it gobbles till you wobble. So she eats a lot of food, and then she's gonna pass out. That happens to her a lot. But that's just a little fluff for you. My favorite thing, oh, this whole decorations is, let me think, let me think. Mm, okay, I really like the leaves that light up because that just, that just, it just gives such a like calming vibe and just so cozy. Like you wanna go to sleep and just, you know, you go to bed and it's just so cozy. And we didn't forget about how Fluffy hung them super nice inside of the house. It looks so good. So cute. I can't wait for fall. It's just starting. I'm so glad, Lamas, that we took the time today to decorate your whole mansion because it looks so cute. But me and the Lamas, we really want to know, what was your favorite part about the whole decorations? Do you think that Little Lamas and Flipping should have did something different? Is it too much or is it too little? Let us know because like, when we decorate in the future, we want to keep your thoughts in mind so like we, we know what to do next time. If you guys really like this decorations, if you really like decorations, we will literally go so crazy for Christmas. Like, we will go all out. Like, ten times a million times more than this. If you like it. So, let us know in the comments below. Do you like this? Do you not? What would you do different? Also, guys, right now, if you have watched this far into the video, me and the llamas, we want to do something a little bit different. Well, we've done this once before, but we want to do it again. So, in the comments right now, if you are still watching this, go leave Happy St. Patrick's Day in the comments below. Why are we doing this? Because we want to confuse everybody else that hasn't made it this far. But if you made it this far, go leave a prank in the comments below. Happy St. Patrick's Day. And we're just going to confuse everybody else. 
living a little prank. Cause these guys, they're crazy. And we'd love to have fun. But yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you like this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Me, little llama bean, and fluff bean. We love you so much. Say bye llama. Bye, say bye fluff. Bye.